Remember this mess? Like Mount Trashmore, Lambert's Point Golf Course was built in a landfill. But five years, it wasn't a problem. Well, then last fall, after Hurricane Irene, that trash started leaking into the Elizabeth River. The city promised to fix the problem, and today, they paid up. Tell your side's Ali Lucia has more. Alvita, the temporary fix for the problem, carried a $180,000 price tag. This fix most likely won't protect it from another Irene, but it will protect the course from most storms, at least through the summer. And you can see the riprap used as a barrier along the water's edge. This fix was placed right along Hole 7. Chris Chambers with the city of Norfolk tells me the reason this area took such a beating was because of the direction of the wind during the storm. Jimmy Leach, the groundskeeper at Lambert's Point, says Irene was a unique hurricane. But I think we, we were hit right at high tide, and the way the, uh, the winds actually came in were probably had created a lot of the damage right there. Um, the course hadn't experienced anything like that previously. We'll be bringing in uh, large boulders, probably in the three to four feet uh, mm -hmm. diameter. Now those boulders Chris is talking about would look more like the large rocks you see here with approval from the city council. The permanent fix is estimated to cost $2.5 million. And if those pairs are approved by the city, they would start in September. Not the greatest day for golf today, but this fix, the golf course groundskeeper told me, should hopefully get them through the golf season this summer. Ali Lucia, 10 on your side.